We're at a job site we're getting ready to wrap up in eastern Jackson County and want to start, I want to take a few minutes and kind of talk about egress windows because this is something we're starting to hit more and more of it. I mean, the, whether you have to have an egress window or not and it is really dictated by the municipality or the area that you live in. As a standard rule, if you have a bedroom, you're going to have to have an egress window and there are, there are exact specifications for that. We're also starting to see now that a lot of the municipalities are starting to require it, even if it's not a bedroom. And I know with homeowners, this can be a little bit confusing because they may have a window or they've got basement windows and it's, they just don't meet specifications. What they're looking for as an egress is for you to be able to get out if the door is closed and there's a fire in the basement. A basement fire or a house that catches on fire and you don't have an egress, the basement literally becomes a death trap. If the fire happens on the upper floors and you're up there, fire department can cut a hole in the wall if they need be. The basement's just not an option. So when we look at this egress window that was put in, we, uh, it's a little bit different because it's actually above grade, and, but we still have to come in with the specifications that the city requires. That's distance to the floor, typically that's 42 inches, and it has to be able to open to a certain size, two and a half square feet for an individual to be able to get in and get out of. There are on occasion where we can't get the sill down close enough to where it's within the 42 inches. Some of the municipalities will allow us to actually put in a, a step there, but you need to know that that step has to be permanent. It has to be attached when you do it. As I said, the egress windows are meant for your safety and the safety of anybody that'd be in your basement in the event of fires. So if you have any questions on that, you know, feel free to reach out to us and be glad to answer them for you.